Good morning, guys. Welcome to Cowbell Farms, where I'm making soap today. I'm just not going to show the entire process on video because I already have making soap on there, but I'm behind four weeks on making soap. I haven't done it in a while. I've been too busy with the garden and getting things ready for that, but I'm going to make a whole lot of sample soaps um, to have on hand um, for giveaways and all kinds of stuff. But today I'm making two batches because that's all the coconut oil that I had. There's only a tiny bit left that I have in my house at the time. So two is what we're getting today. And then I plan to go back to every morning making a batch of soap so that I have them on hand all the time. Um, we have vendor shows coming up. So I've got to get these out there and ready to go. So I ended up with these three trays, one in a little bit, which I'll just keep. I did vanilla pine and rosemary orange, and the bluish green is the vanilla pine, and the coppery looking color is the rosemary and orange. So I've got seven trays and a couple of more. So that is a good batch. That was 80 ounces of coconut oil to do that. If you're interested in the recipe, please comment and I will give it to you. Thank you. So today, April 8th, during the eclipse, I finish Filling up these raised beds for my bean trellis. So I'll be planting green beans, pole beans on the inside, and then I will plant other things on the outside so that I have all this space utilized and not wasting it and can easily weed this and all this grass won't just take over. I'm not saying I won't have any grass, but I'm hoping to put down a path here with gravel so that we don't have to worry about this grass. So I'm gonna landscape fabric and box it up on the ends, run something between here and here just to box it in and then put the gravel in there so that we just have to cut around the sides. I also filled a couple of these round three foot diameter round beds up today. I got three of those filled up today. I still have a few more to fill up later on and I have some more beds to put together, but I think it looks pretty good. It's five cattle panels across. I think they're four foot. So we have 20 feet on each side. So that's 40 foot of growing space that I have available. Mm -hmm. 